All right, what's up everybody? I'm back at it again out here in Cadence, Master Plan Community. This uh, new uh, product here is by DR Horton, and basically we're at Symmetry Summit. Uh, we just got done touring the 44, 28 model. Now we're gonna be f um, touring the 37, 65 model. Now the pricing on here, is um roughly about six hundred and fifty thousand. um they haven't done the grand opening yet like i mentioned in my past video here that uh, we are the first to take a look at this now what i like about this is that the 3765 model you have up to six bedrooms four bathrooms right obviously it is a two-story three-car garage now you have four different elevations to pick and choose from and Let's, let's start to take a look here. Let's see what the hell's going on. One thing I noticed, we got some pavers off to the side here. Here's your entryway into your next gen, folks. That's right. Did I say it? Next gen. You get two houses for the price of one. So let me show you this. Boom. You go through this gate. You have your own entryway and also for the garage. So now we're going to head down this way. Let's go to the main house. First thing I've noticed, boom. Sky bell. Key. We're walking straight back in. Take a look at this. First thing you notice, nine foot ceilings. Now, if you Took a look at the other model. The countertops were actually uh, Petrofina. This one right here is some granite countertops. However, take a look how nice this granite is. One thing that you're going to notice is that with any builder that you deal with, the granite may look similar in color, but may not have the same pattern. Also, another quick tip, depending on how big the island is, like this, right? This is a four by nine. Now, some builders will give you some leftover ass materials, and if they do, make sure the line is down, or the seam is straight down the faucet. Now, as small as this island is, you should actually have one piece. So keep an eye on that, just a quick tip. These are white shaker cabinets. Now with the cabinets, if we take a look, okay, what you get for the money, full dovetails, you got three different colors to pick from, 42 upper cabinets with a three inch crown, four inch backsplash. You do have the option to do a full backsplash too as well. I mean, you are kind of limited. You got some traverse LED lights. You got two recess lights here your, for your pendant lighting, I'm sorry. And stainless steel packaged appliance, Whirlpool, 36 inch cook countertop, okay? Uh, I definitely do like the handles, the modern handles. However, the refrigerator is not included. Does come with the stainless steel undermounted sink, Brush nickel mowing faucet, and again, Whirlpool dishwasher. This is also included as well. Now, right behind this kitchen here, we do have the full walk in pantry. Look how large this is. Okay. Casings around the door are two inch casings, orange peel texture, half inch on the bull nose. Now, this island does seat for four, so it's really nice. Down this way here, we do have our casita. Now, a couple things I do want to show you is important is that this is the only builder right there what you see these are the supply lines for your ac unit i know that they're small but they're all over the place this is so that way they can distribute the airflow equally throughout the house also what's included five inch straight edge on the baseboards 12 by 26 on the tile six inch stagger you get all of this you get all of this on the first floor okay Carpet inside the bedrooms. Now I'm gonna show you this rocker switch. We talked about this on the last home. I need to mention this. This, right, this design with this rocker switch, it allows you to pull this off and change the rocker switch into a dimmer. The reason why they are doing this now is because this should automatically pop off. So if you're not an electrician, you can buy this product. It's just a snap in, snap out. Now another thing I wanna show you, Eight foot slide, typically you get the six foot slide. However, this comes with it also with this covered patio. 
for all the price of about $650,000. But I talked about this. These things are fl flimsy. They're not your top notch. However, if you add everything all together overall, value at the price, how many bedrooms, the next gen. If you take a look at the lot size, I mean, look at this lot size. Lot size is roughly about 10,000 square feet. A couple things that come with it. Obviously, you're gonna get the two condensers here. And then we have our gas line. Nice covered patio. However, let me know in the comments below if you already seen the bigger model, which floor plan you like the best. Now I'm not gonna walk over there because I'm just too lazy. And I'm about to lose my breath. You do have pre-wire with distributed sounds or surround sounds. You do get your Cat5 with the Smurf tube, right? So that way you can go ahead and mount your flat screen TV. Now, another thing is here, because you got the pre-wire, make sure you get the pre-wire for your sub. It's probably sitting right there. That's what I'm thinking. So just make sure to identify that, okay? We got a thermostat here, doorbell here. Four more dining room goes here, which is really nice. Now we're gonna head over to the next gen. So this is a whole nother living area. Again, tile, all this stuff comes with it. Here's your front door. Now we're gonna flip this thing around. So, mother-in-law, father-in-law, whoever, be staying here, carpet. You got your transfer duct, which is really nice here. That just connects to your main AC unit for your return line, your walk-in closet. Carpets, and eh, not that great. I don't like this color, but I'm sure you can choose a different color. Uh, the padding is pretty okay on here, believe it or not. Now let's take a look at this bathroom. Definitely love the high cabinets on here, okay? You got your 36 inches on the cabinet with another two inch face here, and this is all granite. This is a beautiful piece of marble. It's actually, I don't, why am I saying marble? It's not marble. I mean, it's granite, it's rock. However, it just looks nice. Y'all know what I mean, because, I mean, take a look at this. I gotta look at it again. Yeah. Got the window here. Now take a look at this kitchen. So it looks like your TV would go here, small little couch. Again, you got the nice granite undermounted sink. You're gonna have a microwave right here, 42 upper cabinets. Refrigerator is not included. HOA is here about $50 a month. Thermostat here. And take a look at this, double stack washer and dryer. I would probably wall this up and rent this thing out for like $1,300 to $1,500 a month. You'd probably get away with it. You also have your access to the garage too as well. Here's the, here's the three quarter bath, not three quarter, quarter bath. And then we have our linen closet. All right, we're gonna come down this way. Here is the three car garage right here. Off to the left, we have our closet. Here is our smart panel box. This is only 18 inch, very small. I prefer it to be bigger. You got more storage underneath here. And I love how they finish the uh, tile all the way underneath that uh, staircase. Here is a room up in the front of the house. However, this room's a little bit small. Really not filling this room. However, this is great for an office space. You got the Cat5 coax cable right here. Transfer girl right there. LED right above and two cans. Now let's take a look at the walk-in closet. Not bad for a walk-in closet. Now we're gonna make our way upstairs. You have a nice banister, all completely open. The staircase is a little bit wide, which is really nice. You got two landings. You automatically make that U-turn. Now, I've never been up here before. We're gonna look at this at the same time. As soon as I come up, off to my left, we have a nice loft area. One thing I would like to like to do here is do a, a banister all the way across because this would literally open it up. I don't think that's an option though here with this builder. Now this is a nice loft area, nice and open, but I'm thinking I'm liking the other model better. Let me know in the comments below. 
check it out. Now here's the primary as you enter. Nice feature wall, that's something that you guys could do for fairly cheap. It's not gonna cost you that much. Nine foot ceilings, transfer duct, again, orange peel textured. You also have your um, thermostat right here too as well. Now let's go take a look at this bathroom. As we come into the bathroom, 12 by 24, six inch stagger, uh, three eighths on the grouse line. Tub, we talked about this fiberglass tub. I wish it was a little bit longer, but I do like the cladding all the way around. Now these are actually one whole slab right here, which is really nice. You gotta watch out. Some of the guys, especially like the trades that come in, they'll try to split this one. Like this one, they did split, but they didn't do a book match here, which is I totally understand, but for the price, Hey, it is what it is. But if you can get one whole slab, it just makes more of a cleaner look. Like this one is one whole slab right here, okay? Now we have two 36 inches on both sides, which is nice. Down the center, we have our walk-in. Now, as far as like overall the layout of this, I don't know if I'm feeling this. I feel like this is a lot of wasted space. I think I would like to continue this all the way across and have a door here to my closet. Cause now you just lost all this cabinet space. I don't know, let me know in the comments below. Then we have the linen closet here. Then our water closet, nothing special, but let's take a look at the supply line. Okay, so this is a quarter turn, which is I prefer a quarter turn. However, make sure to hold the base of that if you are turning off your water, okay? Another quick tip I just wanna share with you. Uh, typically, at the primary toilet is connected to the sprinkler systems throughout your house. The reason why they do every flush, it flushes it out that system, just in case if your house catches on fire, you're not getting that stinky, like, you know, that moldy smell, okay? Washer and dryer, very large laundry room. Obviously this is not included. Your attic access is gonna be right above here. Now you do have an option to put a sink here. It's already pre plum which is really nice. You can come in and do that after. Love the fact, okay? Another thermostat here, we got bedrooms. One, two, three, let's start off down this hallway so that way we get into every single nook and cranny to this. Okay, so we have the linen closet. Coming into this bedroom, very stale, very plain. There's nothing exciting about this. However, it is large, okay? Very large. Again, nine foot ceilings. We have our walk-in closet. And now, let's head down here to the left. We have another bedroom. Bedroom, same thing. Now, this one doesn't have a walk-in closet. You do have a slider right here for your closet door, okay? Transfer duct again, and right above we have a traverse LED light. Now, coming into this bedroom, let's see what we have here. So the bedroom is pretty much the same, just flipped in reverse. Now this one's unique. You have, uh-oh, what's going on with my camera? Give me a second, okay. So this one's unique, you have four supply lines for the can line. Probably the reason why is because where this home is facing, it's probably gonna get a lot of sun exposure, it's gonna get a lot of baking to this house, so that's the reason why it's designed like that. Coming into the bathroom, 24 by um, 12 by 24 tile, again, nice countertops, all the same, matches throughout the whole house. You got the aqua tub, my favorite brand, if you're gonna do this product, Fiberglass tub, shower, combo, all one piece. All right. Now I'm gonna take you guys, what else we got? Okay, so that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, I'm curious to know uh, which one you guys like better. If you guys haven't had a chance to look at the bigger model, I'll see if I can uh, remember to have a link in the description below. Other than that, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Chuck, it's Chris Watt. Also, hey, real quick, one more thing. When you come here, okay, look for my girl, Farah. Ask for Farah, okay? And make sure, let her know that you've seen this video and that you're working with me so that way I can get you the best deal. I'm talking about very low rates, right? Incentives. I'm talking about, um, uh, what do you call it? Incentives as far as price reductions. Look, great deal. I don't know. Just, just let my girl know. Other than that, be blessed, folks. 
All right, did you guys actually like that video? If you guys like that video, then that tells me that you may be interested in watching more video home tours. If you guys want to check out all our video home tours, we have over 1,800 video home tours. Just go ahead and click on this right here on this video right here. Now, if you guys are in the market and you want to purchase a home and want to get started, visit lvhomeexperts.com. It is a great website to get started. Or take out your phone and go ahead and uh, scan this QR code right now. Go ahead and take the time and do that. Also, if you guys just love real estate and want to get into real estate and you want to learn everything about real estate, go ahead and subscribe to our second channel, Chuckets 2.0, Everything Real Estate. Other than that, if you like this video, let us know in the comments below what your thoughts are about this video. Until next time, peace.